Now breaking news at 5 as investigators release new information about that fatal crash in Clark County that killed four people. Authorities say the truck driver that hit the bus was simply going too fast for conditions. Sonu Wasu live with more on exactly what happened that day. Sonu? That's right, Mark. Troopers say unsafe speed on slick roads is what caused the driver of the semi to lose control. Now, we have just learned today that according to the data recorder box inside the truck, the driver was traveling 57 miles an hour. While that is below the posted speed limit, troopers say that's still much too dangerous on a snow-covered highway. Now, this was the scene on Interstate 70 when the semi lost control, jackknifed and slid across the median, slamming into a shuttle bus filled with adults with developmental disabilities. Four people were killed in the crash, six others injured. Troopers call this a very complicated investigation, not only because of the size of the vehicles involved, but the fact that most of the victims were restrained and wheelchair-bound. The 54-year-old driver of the semi, Zygmunt Wykoski of Illinois, worked for a company called Highway Transport Chemical Incorporated. His trailer was empty at the time of this crash. To be charged, and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the report to the prosecutor's office here in Clark County, have them take a look at it and recommend charges. Now, at this time, troopers do not believe alcohol or drugs played a factor in this crash, and we're told that or troopers actually are advising all drivers to use caution and drive slower than the posted speed limit in bad weather conditions. Reporting live in Springfield, Sonu Wasu, 2 News on your side. Also happening now, the Dayton bomb.